install the boat EFX step system. Yep. Like that, something like that? Yeah, something okay. like that. That's perfect. What's going on, everybody? We're doing a DIY. DIY. We're going to do a DIY. Do your, what is it? I do it think yourself. it's do it yourself. Do yourself it. It's DIY. Yeah, DIY. DIY. There's a network for it. We should, be, we should be on it. Yeah, that'd be interesting. <laughs> That's terrible. We get canceled. Yeah, yeah, 100%. <laughs> so we're putting the Boat FX boat step on this here boat. The boat step system. Yeah. It's got a stripper pole. That's, you know, handle the whole nine. So. <laughs> I am. You're going to see a bunch of that now that we have see, this. You're going to see that as a thumbnail. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> so uh real quick it comes in three basic pieces to the step being the main piece and then the main arm bracket main arm bracket and this angles back towards the boat just for a little bit easier the cool thing with this step system is that you have like a bunch of adjustment here we'll show you when we get to it but like yeah this can be angled a bunch of different ways you'll Which see is that pretty cool yeah super simple uh we went ahead i ordered the step covers i guess or the grip it's marine mat yeah which is, what it is. super sweet yeah because um, you don't well i know you want to see it but i don't want to see <laughs> me slipping off of these right. steps also you could use grip tape which we also have about i don't know a thousand yards of <laughs> and we didn't use that didn't i don't even think about that until right now yeah but in any case um you can use that as well and not pay the extra 40 bucks or whatever it was it's not that much uh we'll put everything in the link down below as far as like um, where to get this if you guys are interested. Uh, we paid full retail. We are not sponsored by Boat FX by any stretch. But out of the different steps that we looked at, this, is the best one. this one was the best one, yeah. in our opinion. I was very so, impressed with how sturdy that step was. Yeah, it handles up to 450 pounds, which is... <laughs> I mean, yeah, because, you know, we are not at it, but, you know. <laughs> We're not 450, but by any... Well, not even close. But it's nice to have a little bit extra. So, I've seen dudes hit their step, and that thing is like, wow, yeah. wow. Yeah, yeah. I'm not about that. So. so it's got some extra stuff, and it, you know, it's got a crossbar here, which is pretty cool. Obviously, you can get it in a bunch of different colors. So, I mean, I guess let's just get into it. Yeah, right? uh, I'm gonna go through this this stuff real quick. These are okay. your, this is your mounting bracket. You're gonna see how that comes into play. These are your mounting bolts. These are five eighths, just so you guys know when you go to grab your gun or your ratchet or whatever you're gonna do. These are five eighths. Um, handle hardware that mounts to the step. Those are 7 16 And then the step adjustment, how you can turn it and mount the actual handle to the main handle bracket is a, man, I had that all in my head. That's a, yeah. sorry, that's a 7 16 Right. These are halves. There it is, 5 8 half 7 16 Yeah. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. We're gonna put it on loose and uh, make sure that the actual steps themselves are pretty parallel with Line the ground. You guys can adjust that. I mean, you've got a little bit of play. Every boat's a little bit different, especially on this neck right here, which is where it's going to go. And you just kind of have to figure out where this thing is going to fit. Now, some of these need to be bolted in. Like some of them have to be like through drilled. Bolt. Yeah, through bolted, drilled. Depends on the neck size here. Ours doesn't, thank God. Um, yeah, it's a pain. Yeah, it's a pain in the ass. But You'll just have to kind of check that, check into it. And again, these guys, uh, they, they build a pretty awesome step. So I don't know, you wanna get into Let's it? Let's roll it, Let's dude. Let's do it, okay. So you got those on that side. First thing we're gonna do is get this main step and get these bolts through. So that I can feed it to him on the other side. I can't see past my hand. I got it. It's hmm. interesting. Yeah. It's all about test fit. Why is that going in? <laughs> There's a freaking. There's a little bit of a burr. How funny is that? I'll well, show we, you can, how we do that. Yeah. That's going to be a. Will you just hold that for a second? Yep. Stuff's not perfect. Sometimes you got to use a hammer. There's a little burr in there. Suppose we could, probably just could have reamed that out, but yeah, but I mean, we got a hammer, can, so yeah. Why do that when we can hammer it? So this thing mounts down here, and on our boat, it really it can go about right there, and that's it. Yeah. 
You can see it's above this bracket that holds on the winch between that and this plate that comes out to hold the winch on the bottom. He's just sliding the other mounting bracket on the other side. This thing's pretty self-explanatory, but you know, there is instructions. There is. Another good thing about mounting it here though, uh, at least on our trailer, is that this, it, that bottom bolt is gonna rest up against this arm right there that holds the winch in, so it's gonna give even a little more support, which is great. Perfect. And it is tight, like a toyga. Quite like a toyga. We're gonna have to pull that other one out. That's a little Hammer it out a little bit. Can yeah. I let go of the slack on this? Oh, there you go. Okay. Okay, there it is. Just like that. Now, we don't have a whole lot of play, so there's not a lot of adjusting that we can do as far as where this step is actually gonna end up. We're just gonna make sure both plates are flush. Yeah, basically. Good? Yep. Good? Yep. Good? Yep. Do that top one, the first one again. There you go. Okay. Yeah, that ain't going nowhere. Yeah. All right, so let's tighten down a place. Boom. So your main step handle bracket. There's a plate right here. Flat. It mounts to this plate right here. Also flat. <laughs> and it just goes straight like that. So a little bolt with our washers on this side. Grab the nuts with the washers for the other side. I'll have there we go. Yeah, yeah. Give those a pull. Straight through. Pretty self-explanatory. You just go and put the washer and nut on. Yeah. <laughs> Easy as that. Last piece, the actual step is your actual handle. And you guys notice it's got this like rings. So that makes it so you can adjust it any way you want. To be honest, I think it's almost square on. That's yeah, I think square on is probably the best because you got to be able to get to it from both sides. Yeah. You know, from going up and getting down. Yeah, that's the deal there. So when you get it lined up where you want it, these nuts and bolts just go straight through those little quarter cutouts. Now the real test. Perfect. Look at that. Pretty easy way to get on and off. Pretty efficient way to do so, I would say, yes. Uh, if you did buy the... Uh, marine mat non slippers. Just make sure you wipe off your step before you try to do it. You don't need to hit it with alcohol or anything. These things are super sticky. Here's the question Do you go boat FX going that way, re readable, or this way? Go that way. Goes that way. Okay. Whew, yeah, those are sticky. Yeah. And simple placement peel and stick. I mean, that's it in I mean, under, what, 10, 15 minutes probably? Probably 20, <laughs> about 20 minutes worth of work maybe? Start to finish, yeah, that includes un opening the box. Yeah, and you gotta have, I mean, it's it's gonna be 100 times better if you have somebody with you. Yeah, um, a little bit. Even, even if they're just spotting. So if you're over on that side, they're over on this side, all they're doing is lining this thing up. It's super simple, but it's good to have a buddy. Yeah, otherwise sure. you're like trying to hold this thing under your arm and prop it up on your shoulder yeah. while you put that plate on. Do it with two people. You could do it with a jack, I suppose, but it just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Just get somebody out real quick, it's 15 minutes out of their day. Yeah. You know? And not and even that, because all you really need them to do is hold it for the plate, so. Yep. You're good. That's it. That's it. We're done. 20 minutes worth of work for a lifetime 
of easiness on the water. Yeah. Let's go watch football. <laughs> Let's do that. All right. We'll see you next time. It's also raining. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Which means we need to get that thing out of it. Yeah. <laughs>